Good morning and welcome to the Mike Show for Friday, July 1st, 2022. 68 degrees at 8.34 a.m. and I am your host, Vak Kamal, and I am a sinner. Where did June go? And before we go any further, Liz Hurley's Jubblies are 57 years, 20 days, 1 hour, and 54 minutes old. I'm here with my brother, Prince and co-star, Max. I just put some of that stuff on his nose. And he's licking it off, but he seems to be doing better. I think it's finally healing. Sammy's over here. we got to give him his pill. Mikey's out on the stoop. I don't know where else is, and I think Sully's outside somewhere. We're sleeping out at camp. I did not sleep well. I did not have pleasant dreams. I did get some sleep, and it was nice just lying out here during the different rainstorms we had during the night. Sammy was with me, Else was with me. Everybody, for the most part, was sleeping out here at camp. We're enjoying a nice coffee this morning. Here's that stuff we put on it, Maxie's nose. Yeah, Max. We also put that stuff in Mikey's ears and Sully's ears. It's an antibiotic. Oh boy, let's do a recap from yesterday. Got a ride in at Norway Ridge. That was good. That was a good thing. And then I think I just came and hung out with the loves. Worked from 4 till 9. It was fairly busy. We had enough people on. I got home about 8.30. Or I left at work at 8.30. I was supposed to work till 9. But I didn't mind getting out earlier. I was having some... Those ocular migraines where you get flashing on your eyes. And I've had them before. and It was really tripping me out there. I wasn't sure, you know. And then I remembered I had them before. And I think I was just dehydrated. Because once I got home and drank more water, um, I felt a lot better. But anyway, I got some bad news. Uh, my outlaw, my ex-brother-in-law passed away his... My nephew called me yesterday and left a message and found out his father passed away and it was, it was a sad thing and God bless you kids, Diana and Sean and oh, I can't think of his name, Aaron. <laughs> I was a shitty uncle and I still am, what can I say? I'm a sinner. Oh, but I do what I can for these kittens. Is, you know, I guess I always figured if they had so many uncles and aunts, they didn't need another one trying to fuck up their lives for them. <laughs> they could be a good example or a bad example either way. Well, it sure looks like it might rain again, and it wouldn't break my heart. Because it's nice weather, I want to go bike riding, even though my body's telling me right now to rest. But the ego, vanity, and false pride just want to get rid of this big tank I got, and it won't let it go. Hey, Mickey. Yeah. We had a good time hanging out with the loves last night when we got home, and they were sitting... They're, they're going underneath the spruce tree for some reason. I just had to brush a bunch of stuff out of Mikey and out of Max. But uh, they're having a great time going underneath that spruce tree for some reason. Oh, boy. We're going to take a break. Welcome back, and I don't really mean that at all. Um, you know, the linden tree should be flowering pretty soon, and I don't smell anything, and it don't seem like it's quite ready to. That's that one straight out there, and... Uh, yeah, last year at this time it was in full bloom, so maybe I'm missing out on something. Maybe my sniffer's not working very good, but summer is progressing. It starts with in late spring with the, the apple blossoms and the violets and the lilacs and then the wajela and then the Oh the flowering linden. Oh those rotten dogs are barking next door. God help me. Anyway, I was gifted with a real treasure at work last night. 
A customer came up and said there was quite a mess in the bathroom, and before it got any worse, maybe somebody should go up and take care of it. And we had a customer that shit all over the toilet seat, shit all over the bowl of the toilet, the rim of the toilet, and left about a probably 50 yards of toilet paper in there too. You know, it was fun going in there pearl diving for that. But me being a professional turd herder, I took care of it. So anyway, I don't know what we're going to do today. I really don't. I work from 4 to 9, and I am actually looking forward to it. Hopefully there's some excitement in the air about the holiday, the Independence Holiday Weekend. I hate calling it 4th of July. It doesn't mean nothing. Independence Day says a lot more about what the day actually means. I know I'm fighting a losing battle like I often do, but I will fight it nonetheless. We're back again, and guess who's joined us? What are you doing, Sully? Can you talk to me? You having a good adventure, Bobby? Look at the size of that beast. He's a big boy. Maxie's still sitting here, purring up a storm. Yeah. Sully's getting a drinky now. Oh boy, so I have the weekend off this weekend. I work today, I work 4th of July, but I do have this weekend off. And I think I'm going to help at the soup kitchen tomorrow since I haven't done that since I started working at, back at Save a Lot. But I don't know, we got to get through today and we got to get through right now. And it just feels so good to sit here. But I gotta get rid of this big tank I got on me, so I'm probably gonna have a bike ride of some kind today. Maybe a heart attack to go with it, who knows. Alright, we're back. I had a shave, I ran a brush through my hair and put a hair tie in. I made a couple iced coffees, or in the process of making them. Uh, I'm still here, I'm with Sully. And Samuel. And Mackie. I don't know where the Princess or Mikey are. Uh, to the 8 billion of you who do not tune in on a regular basis, my niece had an ablation, whatever that is, something to do with the heart yesterday, and I guess it turned out successfully, so I wanted to mention that also. Um, what else can we tell you about today, tomorrow, yesterday, or the upcoming events in our lives? I just don't know. It just doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. I think I'm going to have a pretty lazy low-key day today. I don't know. I might take some recyclables back and any biking that I do. Come on, Sully. Be nice. Sully was trying to break Mikey or Sammy's balls. Sammy, you going to go outside, Bobby? You going to go outside, Bobby? Bobby Samuel? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe we'll just take some recyclables back, run and get a few groceries, take it easy. I am looking forward to tomorrow, though, to be able to go help out at the soup kitchen. Like I mentioned earlier, I haven't done that since early May when I started working back at Save a Lot. So, If you're sitting here watching this, your life's duller than mine. Don't kid yourself. But anyway... Uh, it is our summer fundraiser to keep shitty quality programming like this on the air. We need money, so send us anything you've got. We're really into gold and silver right now, and something backed by gold and silver, backed by something worthwhile, so English pounds would be real good too, but we'll take anything. We'll take anything. We'll take food, too. You know, I remember what food. I remember eating food when I was a kid. And I heard they had to have it during Prohibition for like weeks at a time. But now I'm just window shopping for it. Can't afford it. Look who's just came back. It's Mikey. Come on, Mikey. What are you doing, Bubby? You having a good adventure? We got Cardinal singing outside. It's a beautiful morning. And I'm feeling pretty good. I just... I'm getting pretty stoked from that iced coffee I drank. Sammy's still here. We're just about done with our readings. Look at Sammy. We gave him his pill, as I mentioned earlier. Look at Mackie. And Sully. 
Oh, yeah, it's all right. Yeah, it is. All right, it's time to close. Look at that Mikey over there. He's doing a little grooming. Mikey, Mikey, can you look at the camera? Bobby, Bobby, there's that Mikey. Here he comes. Here he comes. That's my Bobby. Oh, Bobby, did you have a good adventure? There's that Sully again. All right, that's all we got. So happy Friday, and from the cold gray ashes and coals of my cold black heart, my broken, beaten, battered, burdened, hopeless, empty, shattered soul, piss off, happy Friday, and thanks for not tuning in. Tell them, Mikey. Yeah.